I had the MRI done and it showed that I had a mass located on my liver and it was non-cancerous up and I. My name is Juan Sarmiento. I'm an assistant professor of surgery at Emory University. And uh, my focus is uh, surgery of the liver, biliary tract, and pancreas with the emphasis on laparoscopic approaches. And we asked for a second opinion to go talk to somebody. And you know, I told him I wanted to talk to the best. And they led me up here to Dr. Saramento. In the past, we used to do liver resection through a big incisions. Uh, basically, we make incisions from across the abdomen to get access to the liver. The patient used to lose a lot of blood, used to evaporate a lot of water, needed a lot of fluids, and the patient takes lots of time to recover from the operation. It didn't really hit me till that morning when I started walking down the hallway to the, uh, the surgery room. That's when I became very scared. Much of the challenge for a patient in recovering from surgery is related to the pain in their abdominal wall that's caused by the surgery. The advantage, though, of minimally invasive surgery is that it allows us to do the same operation on the liver through three or four small incisions, as well as one larger incision. The advantage of that technique is the minimization of trauma to the abdominal wall so that there's less post-operative pain. And also, the camera introduced into the abdomen magnifies the image that the surgeon sees for the surgery, allowing very careful dissection of the liver. It has tremendous, tremendous advantages compared with the open resection. My wife and my family all around me uh, when I woke up was a great feeling. And uh, I'll never forget that from uh, Dr. Sarmento, what he did for me. One of the major emphasis for surgery is to identify all your strengths and see how you can piece them together to benefit the patients even more. Emory has a great deal of experience with a laparoscopic liver resection and offers what I believe are the best techniques to safely and effectively remove tumors through the laparoscopic approach. There are really a handful of centers in the country who do advanced major laparoscopic hepatectomies. Rather than having individual surgeons operating independently, we bring the best resources and best skills, put them together, and offer them to our patients. This team approach is probably the single best change that our liver program has been going through. My oldest is six years old and uh, she wants to be a doctor. So I told her, you know, I know a great place for you to go to school. <laughs>